What is up everybody? It's Moritz here from Section Store once again. Today we're going to be having a look at one of our most requested sections from our store. It's the scrolling logo cloud and what we're going to be doing today is taking this shop to the next level. We got a logo cloud right here and we're going to turn it into this. So it's going to be a lot more dynamic and I think customers are going to love it. Alrighty, let's jump straight in. If you haven't done so already, head to the Shopify App Store and get the app I'm using for this. It's called Section Store. It's a component library for over 100 fully customizable components. Shopify only exclusive. And after you successfully installed it, you can head back to your Shopify admin area where you want to be looking for Section Store down here underneath apps. Then you're going to click on Explore Sections. The app itself is completely free and this scrolling logo cloud let's let it load up real quick it's going to be a one-time purchase of nine dollars there are no hidden subscription fees or anything it means if you bought it once you're going to own it forever i've already done so so i can head back to the home area of the app itself and i want to scroll down and in this uh, description it says it's for dawn but it basically works for every theme and the one I'm using for this store is called Streamline, so simply click on either Dawn or the Streamline theme or just the one you're using and install it to that. And after you've done so, you can head back to the online store over here and then click on Customize and that's going to open up your Shopify editor. And I have it opened up already. That's the one you could see in the beginning of the video but we want to turn it into a scrolling logo cloud. So I'm going to simply get rid of this and scroll all the way down, click on add section. And here you type in logo cloud and we want to use the scrolling logo cloud. First thing we want to be doing is actually bringing it in the right position, which is going to be here. You can put it wherever you want. We're going to save it all up. Otherwise it's going to look a little bit weird. And I'm going to explain you the concept of the whole thing real quick. Those are all the blocks where you can put in actual logos. So we're going to select an image right here. Let's just put a random one so you get the whole concept. You can also link a page product or whatever you want to it. But I'm happy with that and always make sure you save it up so it gets displayed the right way. There we have it. And the same concept also applies to all the other ones. So I'm just going to delete this one and show you one I've done already. I simply just filled that one with content. I don't want to waste your time, so I'm just going to continue with that. And another thing we can do is actually click on the section itself and do some customizations to the whole thing. Like, for example, changing the width of the icons. We want to have them bigger, which is type in 150 here, and they're going to appear a bit bigger. The scrolling velocity is how fast the whole thing is actually moving. I'm really happy with that right now, so I'm going to keep it like that. We can also change the section background and the slider background. The slider background is what's right underneath the logos. And here we have some simple padding options we can adjust as well. But that was pretty much it already. We can change the heading and the header size as well. But I'd say we just have a look at it, how it's looking in the live version. And then we can wrap it up. And there we have it, perfectly working, scrolling logo cloud, done in less than five minutes. I think that's a pretty good time. Um, yeah, I hope you guys found that useful. And if you did, always feel free to leave a like or a follow. And with that being said, have a good one, guys, and peace out.